What up, ladies and gentlemen? It is Bug Crush bringing you another cast of Tiberium Wars. We're gonna get straight into it. It is Cryptozoid against Naked Dark. I'm pretty sure this is Ouch Ouch or Crunch Crunch, whatever it is. I can't remember if it's Ouch Ouch or Crunch Crunch, but we're just gonna call him Naked Dark. We're just gonna call him Dark. It's not even called Naked. So, Dark being the Nod player, Vanilla. Because there's only three factions in Tiberium Wards. And on the right side, Cryptosaur as the Vanilla GDI. I don't even need to say Vanilla, really, do I? As two Rifle Squad Scouts. Uh, probably going to capture the Spike. Probably going to go two Spikes. He's got a lot of infantry, so... Uh, probably two more engineers. Oh, I'm tired, man. Fuck. Um, probably going to get two APCs. Shadow Team probably out from... Ouch, ouch. There we go. I'm going to call him Dark. From Dark, that's... Um, where's the... Oh, there's the third engineer. So three engineers, they capture this now. The refinery's down. There we go, 250. Uh, infantry's not going to do too well. APC engineer coming out from Cryptosaur. And then uh, everything's cheaper in Tiberium Wars. So the refineries are only 2,000 on this game. So everything runs much, smooth, uh, much smoother, faster, kind of. Oh, oh. Oh, is Cryptosaur paying attention? Oh, he could have got an engineer. He could have got an engineer. That was silly. That was silly. He could have got that. But, oh, he loses an engineer. He loses one engineer. So, that's pretty bad for Cryptosaur. Bikes coming out for Dark. And then Dark should be in a fine position right now if he just gets this engineer in here. He should probably run one engineer away or get these bikes down here. This is silly. This engineer is going to die from this APC. Like, if he sees it, three bikes. Cryptosaur with the APC Pitbull on the defense of the power plant. The APC, uh, I mean, MCV going to the middle. He's going to cap that spike, but this engine. Oh, where's that engineer gone? So, yeah, he ran it. He's, he's run that. He should really use these bikes. That's an obvious position. I always go here to scout for APCs. Uh, I mean, engineers from Nod. Only two refineries and two harvesters out for dark. This is pretty bad, actually. This is this doesn't make sense. He's so far behind. Uh, expand to the middle, so there's that. APC gets the engineer, so engineer goes down for dark, and now he's going to retreat with bikes. But that's pretty, really, really, really bad engagement. He's using two. He's not using these to bomb the power plants from a GDI player. And Cryptozoar should win this game, to be fair. The Dark's just so far behind now. You got eight, you got two Harvesters there. One, two, three, four. He's, he is odd-numbered here. He needs five Harvesters on this field. I mean, he's, his economy is kind of pretty shit, to be honest with you. I mean, his economy could be much better. He's actually going to kill this Harvester. Well, not kill it straight away, but... If he takes out these bikes that he should aim at... Okay, he's took out one bike already. He should get this Harvester, to be fair. Um, hand of Nod coming out. Oh, this is should have gone like three refineries and a war factory. Do I think he could get a better economy right now? Uh, Harvester won't go down, I don't think. This is Tiberium Wars, so they have a lot more health. And the war factory's there. This won't go down. If he, if he can choose these pits properly, it will, actually. If he retreats, it makes no sense. He should dive into this. Is he going to dive into it? Yeah, he's going to get this Harvester. He should now go back. Loses one pit bull for one Harvester. Totally worth it. Refinery goes down. Uh, Secret Shine goes down from Dark. He's going to lose these pit bulls. Not the best control out from Dark. And now he sees this upgrade. So now he should know. Just mass APCs, uh, APCs, Preds, and Snipers will probably win him the game. This APC is just sitting here looking out for Engineers. Pretty good. See, he's not using Q at all. Uh, this is a bad choice. This is a wrong choice. I, I wouldn't do that. This is This is retarded. This is retarded. Um, because Dark's so far behind, you don't want to do this. You just want to go into economy. Like he, he, he could build three refineries, three war factories, and then expand down here right now. He could take the whole Blue Tiberium, but instead he's building fucking infantry against infantry. What a much better. Makes sense. Makes sense. Snipers now, but there's no need for the riflemen. Uh, he could just build a few APCs, like 10 APCs would do a nice job. Uh, these... These are not dead, so I think he just lost that, lost that there. Power plants are there. Oh, these are pit bulls. 
his build order is not making sense to me. Uh, like now going into mass pitfalls now, it makes no sense at all. Uh, if he just had a few few APCs, man. If he just had a few APCs, it'd make I'd be feel much comfortable. And this sniper is just gonna get killed. There we go. What a waste. Rocket. Oh my god. Killer Zor, what are you doing? Why are you building hey! rockets? You're against Nod infantry. Why would you build rockets in a million years? This makes no sense. It makes no sense. He's gonna go in for there, but the infantry's just gonna come down. I think. You know, he's gonna. What? There's no APCs with this, so all he's gotta do is split these rockets up a little bit. He's got no stealth detection. He's got a scan. Maybe he can use a scan. Tech comes out. Uh, he's going rail upgrade, but he doesn't need it. Uh, hopefully, actually, it's a uh, mortar upgrades. That'd make more sense to me now. Mortar upgrade, and it's just really bad. Kelazor, no micro at all. Just really, really bad play. Like zero micro on these tanks. Absolutely no micro Incoming! at all. No good control. Really bad control. Nothing good to see there. That was terrible. Just lost all that for nothing, pretty much. Um. Ouch, Dark's gonna go for the blue type. If he secures this blue Tiberium, I would say it's GG and game over for Kelazor, to be fair. Even with these pit bulls, it's just so much infantry. I, I don't reckon he'll control these pit bulls properly. I don't reckon he'll do what he's supposed to do. Like, he needs them to bump up. He needs to not attack into it yet. He needs to. Yeah, that's the thing. You know, he doesn't. Have, look, they're pretty well split, and he's just, just running hey! in. Just. Uh, Aim it. No, no, now you're hitting your Watch own pit bulls. It. Now you're hitting your own pit bulls. He could actually kill that MTV if he aimed it down correctly, but he's not going to because it's killers all. Infantry it's coming from behind. That's quite Watch good, it. but it's just... Oh, no, dude. He's actually going to get this. Wow, he actually got the MTV desire. So two barracks out from ouch, ouch only. So all he needs to do now is build snipers and he wins. That's it. Gonna get the bunkers down. Kill this barracks. Kill this barracks. This is a big deal. Kill this barracks. This is a very big deal. This barracks. Very, very big deal. Because he's only got two barracks. So you don't want him having a third one. Especially not next to the uh, blue top here. So before all these bunkers go down. You can kill that with your pit bulls. Like, okay. Just sit there and do nothing with your snipers and pit bulls. Yeah. Yeah, you must be microing so fucking hard over here. Doing nothing. And that... Him not killing this hand of Nod is going to be the biggest fucking mistake of this game. Did well, he didn't even, like, oh my god. If you killed this, reinforcements would take so long to get to him. But all he needs to do is Sonic emitters right now. That's that's everything. He doesn't even need to try anything now. He doesn't need to build infantry. It's a big mistake. He just needs, just needs a few MCVs and that's game over. That's it. Instead, he's going rifle squads, being a very... Uh, I don't want to say bad player, but not very good play, you know? This is retarded. Like, that, if even Firehawks, like Orcas, anything, just to kill these barracks. You you must know when you see this much infantry and no vehicles that he has no MCV left. As soon as you see this, you just know. And he let him harvest all the blue Tiberium. Oh, my God. Dragonauts are just going to go down for free. Shockwave artillery for 10 rocket infantries when you have about 20 pit bulls. Perfect Incoming! game sense. And you're not even aiming properly, you're just letting him die. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. You could kill this hand of Nod, like, in four hits with your pit bulls. But we won't Watch do that, it. will we? No, we won't We won't do anything, you know. Sonics go down. Okay, he's doing okay there. Just kill the hand of Nod, dude, what the fuck? God, you're so annoying. What the fuck, it frustrates me. This frustrates me. What, why are you still building riflemen? What, have you not learned anything? What are you doing? He's only got infantry. Why would you go infantry against only infantry? Just a, a commando. A commando, really? Really? Like, okay. But I, 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 I whatever. He's gonna die. Didn't even hear that. Could have just jetpacked that away and then healed it. Harvesters could run over all these rockets, but no, we're not going to. We're not going to. Oh, now we turn around and then we go total fucking opposite way. Some great micro out from there. Obviously, can't multitask four units. Some players have very hard times multitasking a few units, obviously. And Sonic Emitter goes down. And there's no way Dark should even win this, but I, I, I reckon he's going to win just by fucking how stupid Kelazor is being. What the fuck, dude? 
Like, why are you camping one position when you have total control? Like, you have no Sonic emitter building? Are you serious? Now you start building? Oh my god, if he kills this MTV, like, no repair, no silos, no barracks in middle so you can stop it. Oh my god. MCV actually goes down. He knew about that infantry forever. Darks is going to come in with rockets on each side. And Dragonox, use the harvesters to crush everything. Just use the harvesters. you got to save that. Just use your harvesters. Just use your harvesters. Sell these Sonic Emitters and use your harvesters. Dude, they have like a thousand HP. Just use the harvesters. Watch out! Oh my god. Dragonox is going down, giving an elite for free. Oh, no, let's drop snipers right in the fucking middle of everything. Uh, now you use them. Now, bit late. Incoming. Bit late. And you use a Great. fucking zone Watch trooper it. drop for one Dragonaut? That's so expensive. And they're just gonna die. That's so expensive. Incoming. You can't even afford to do oh. that. Oh wow. More infantry. Some smart hey. oh, pit walls go down. Watch you just press Q Incoming. on that and you just lost everything. You literally just Q moved everything and lost everything. Wow, more infantry. Retard, retarded, retarded. Watch I'm so getting Watch demonetized, but oh wow. Uh, this replay was game of the week, obviously, because Pelos is so fucking pro. I honestly thought this might be a good game, but this is just ridiculous. I'm still going to upload it because I spent the time casting it, but still, still, this is ridiculous. This is just really bad play from Pelos Like, awful. Like, terrible. Like, this guy has like 5,000 games on this game. It's like, whatever, dude. Like, I know we have our off games and bad games, but dude, come off it. Like, what the fuck? Like, he only has barracks. He doesn't even have anything. Incoming. All you had to do was build a few Sonic Watch emitters it. here and here, Incoming. and that would be it. Some snipers, but no. You could just build rebuild. He could still win. He could still win. He just needs to rebuild that. He just needs to use them snipers. He just used, needs Incoming. to use them and not lose his war factory. It's so fucking easy. Oh, my God. And now he only has a barracks. That is the most Incoming. biggest fucking retarded thing I've ever seen in my days. Like, what? How possibly did you lose this? You're going to go, in, uh, yeah, because you're not going to be able to win infantry against infantry. i tell you why. He can even see the... Oh. My. God. Ew. For real. I need, I need to drink some of my tea quick. I can't deal with this. Okay, kill, kill the tripod. Dragonaut, sorry. Now he pushes. Now he pushes. Are you serial? Take cover. And then, you know, he's Incoming. actually going to use harvesters just to run it over. Why are you running? Just fucking sit there and kill him before he kills all your infantry. Watch out. Watch he didn't, even, didn't even run further enough. He didn't even do it properly. He didn't even do it properly. Get you lose all your snipers because you didn't do it properly. Wow, you meant to aim You meant to aim a squad one by one. And that is GG. He literally so he sold his defense. Oh my, you would not sell your Sonic committers. And that's it. Darks won this. I uh, try and skip it a little bit. I don't want it to, uh... So, anyway, yeah. But, yeah, I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone who supported me on Patreon so far. I mean, I would cast this game, but it's pretty shit. And, um... Yeah, it's been really helpful. Uh, I'm going to leave a link in the description, like always, for my Patreon to keep supporting the videos I bring to my YouTube. Because I get demonetized on every video now. I don't know why. It's probably my swearing. But, apparently, it gets reviewed and... Blah, blah. It doesn't meet the standards. Well, fuck, fuck YouTube. I don't really give a fuck. Fuck them. That's why, why I get demonetized. But yeah, but yeah, big thank you to all my patrons so far. And thank you to everyone who does become a patron. And it's really cool. And it's really supportive. Like I said, I'll leave a link in the description. And at the end of the video, there should be a link to, for it on the top left or right. But yeah, just main infantry coming in here now. Um, I hope you guys didn't mind the mix-up of Tiberium Wars. I was going to cast some Red Alert 3 as well. And Tiberium Wars and Kane Drafts and do it all. But this is the first Tiberium Wars replay in a while. And it might be a fucking... I might have to pick a better one. But this was replay of the week and I was wondering why. I thought it was going to be better. But apparently Tiberium Wars players don't know what a good game is and what a bad game is. Because this is just... Re 
ridiculously a bad player being bad and then a good player being good and just winning it. Pretty simple. I mean, if Keller Zorge had built like a second MCV, some snipers and pushed, he would have won. But nope. You know, he went he went rifle squads against a fucking nod upgraded military squads. Like he literally has increased movement movement of speed, increased hit points, and then he has increased the squid combat effectiveness. Throws them fucking grenades while fuck your whole units up and what what why you can't build infantry against nod really because the fucking grenades hit you and it's ridiculously strong. Take cover So yeah. This is retarded. This is just going to be... I might just Take end it if it doesn't... I, I can't be fucked to watch this. This is annoying. Like... Like, you can't win anyway. Because you can never push. You can never push against a Nod player. Unless he got, like, two eight... Unless he got engineers in his barracks and then... But all we have to... There we go. Killazar has been defeated. Well played to... Ouch, ouch, dark... Um. Yeah, if you guys liked the video, make sure to leave a like. Uh, if you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you haven't subscribed, make sure to hit subscribe for more videos. All that bullshit. I don't know. Um, you see this? Look at this. Fucking look at this. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Fuck. Like, all he had was him. Look at that. Favorite unit. Rifle squad against militant squad. Oh, so retarded. But yeah, good games. Uh, yeah, link to the description for my Twitch and Patreon. I hope you guys have a good day and take care.